Well, this is the battery that I made with the lead for that funny little red and white car. I've got it back on balance charge and it's actually coming up much better this time. I'm just wondering if one of my solder joints wasn't very good. And it's high resistance. Because this time through it seems to be balancing much easier and it's not getting hot at all. That's odd. Yeah, I might have a loose lead. Look at that. That's just dropped down because I've just moved it. Hmm. I have to keep an eye on this. That is strange. Well, maybe there's something inside that's shorting out on one of the batteries and just getting hold of it and moving it. Is changing the internal resistance because that's just changed completely now now the second cell is fully charged and the first one's dropped back mind you that is what balance charging does it charges one side at a time hi guys we're out at sainsbury's just been another midday snack or midday meal i was rather hoping there might be nobody over on the skate park over there so I could have given this little fella a run round look there's loads of people over there so I might just give it a little run round in the car park here hopefully I won't lose it and it won't get run over got the mini camera on top the SQ11 Lights on, press that one, turns red, press that one time, should be recording. going on there seem to have some sort of interference. I have no idea what's going on there. Seems to have some sort of interference. I don't know what's going on there. Unless my battery's low on me. Oh. I'm not sure. It might be. 
might be low battery on this. That would make sense. Oh, that's annoying. home again I've changed the battery in the controller in case it was low it was a bit low but it wasn't terribly low so I, I'm not quite sure what was going on I don't know if we were getting some sort of interference out there I've played around with the trim a little bit because that does seem to make a difference you sort of got to balance it between steering and throttle so we'll just have a little run in the conservatory and kitchen here camera back on again if it's got still got any battery in it to get it to funny again. Hmm. 
Well, I'm not quite sure what the problem is. Whether it's battery level, whether it is actually the ESC is playing up, or whether it's the receiver playing up. I'm going to have to swap each of them one at a time to see if we can find what the problem is. Hmm. Well, that was an unexpected twist. I was hoping we could just go out and give it a straight run. But there'll be another episode now, I suppose. Well, I'm not sure, but I might have cracked it. You might remember I said that was a 2S, 3S ESC that I put in there. And I'm thinking it might be low voltage causing a problem. Because I've just changed it to a 3S, which is going to burn the motors out. but it seems to be responding better. So that might be what it is. The 2S that I put in there was a bit of an iffy 2S. It had some problems with it. And it maybe it drops off the voltage when it's under load and then we lose control. So maybe I should have bought the 2S Yes, sees. Yeah. Well, maybe next time I'll try it with a 3S when we go out. It would be a shame if we burn the motors out, but at least we'll find out if that's what the problem was. Thanks for watching. You'll always find more information down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. You might like to subscribe just here. Over here is my latest video on my channel. And down below is a playlist related to what you've just been watching. Thanks again for watching.